What's going on guys, Spot on Tech here. In today's episode of The Tech Spot, we're going to be talking about the brand new chat features of Facebook. And we're going to be going over them, uh, how to use them, uh, what I think of them, and so on and so forth. Alright, so the first new feature of Facebook, um, actually before I get into that, uh, let me tell you the backstory. Facebook rolled out these couple of new features the other day in their conference. People were expecting video chat, and they got video chat. Group chatting, they also got group chatting. But um, they also did a couple overhauls to the chat list that I'm going to show you right now. All right, so the first thing that they did was they completely changed up your sidebar. And what I mean by that is um, over here where my, where my cursor is, it, this right here is the sidebar now. And what it is is your most recently contacted friends. It's no longer all of your friends. Uh, it's only the most recently contacted ones, and you can't edit that. However, if you want to talk to someone that's not in this list, no problem. You can just search them up. Um, right here and they'll pop they'll pop right up it's no problem but the, it's just kind of an issue for me I mean I don't really like this whole new um, sidebar layout but I'll get used to it I always get used to their brand new things um, but what you can still do is you can hide the sidebar so it comes over there open it back up um, you can limit your availability to people you could always do this but now it's a bit more obvious on how to do it so you have your friend list for example I have a list of friends that I don't want to always talk to so I have them in a send offline group so if I check that box it'll send those friends offline so they can't talk to me so it's kinda of like being invisible on Gmail uh, if you want to think of it like that so that's that's the new sidebar feature um alright uh, let's go into the new video chat feature now I haven't tried this yet so this is gonna be my first time it's gonna be new for both of us um, alright so I have a laptop set up here to my right and I'm using my laptop right here as well and we're gonna try and start a video chat here and let's see if this works I hear online video chat is disabled by default but um, if that's the case then I'll, I'll uh, show you how to enable it but we might as well just give it a shot alright start a video call set up like yes set up video calling let's just take a moment here unless it is blocked online like how I thought it was um, run the download file and enjoy your first call okay so let's give this a shot let's see what happens here online never tried it alright Facebook video calling open install agree just give it a moment here I'll tell you what I'll pause the video and I'll come back right when this is over alright guys so we're back it says the update was installed successfully so now we're going to try and run the file one more time and see if this works alright and it looks like we got some popped up here just give it a second Let's see what this is alright so Facebook video calling is now downloading we'll give that a moment to download it's going pretty quick. All right, finishing up. Just give it a moment here. <laughs> All right, and it looks like we're good here. Maybe it's not blocked online anymore, so I won't have to show you guys. All right, so on the second computer, second computer over here, you guys can't see it, but it's asking me to set up video calling, so I'm going to do that right now. Uh, this shouldn't take too long because, um, yeah, on hers it's going much faster because Lion didn't have the correct components, so I had to install something. But for her, it's just going real quick. It's almost done there, so we should be seeing some video pretty soon. Alright, and there we go. Let's try this. Answer the call. It says connecting on this computer, by the way. Uh, so it should show up here for a second. Oh, okay. The video call plugin encountered an error when starting. So I wonder what that means. Let's try this. If this ever happens to you, let's give this a shot. We go into 
we go into uh, let's see here preferences in Safari then we're gonna go into advanced and click show develop menu in the menu bar once we do that let's go up to the menu bar and click develop user agent and let's change it to Safari 5.06 Mac and see if it'll let us see if it'll let us video call after that All right, so let's try that one more time with the same person uh, try and initiate a video call here after we just did all of that to try and get it working um, okay so let's do this um, let's try and quest a video call here alright now you can't see this but on this computer it says incoming call so I'll answer that call and see what happens just wait for a little for bit, bit. alright All there right, we go so we have the video, video popping up so what we did before, before did, did in fact that. work it, it did, did work, work. and um, now, now we're video, video calling call here. here and, and you can't see this on this screen, but I'm like showing up in high definition over here on this screen. But uh, let me turn this over here. So you can see now over here. Um, so video chat is working, as you can see. It's working pretty well. Um, there's a bit of lag, but that's to be expected in the video, video chat service. So that's just the norm. All right, so we can close this call now, now that we know that it works. Okay, call ended. And, well... Looks like Facebook video chat does work after all. Um, but um, yeah, if you're on Mac OS 10.7 Lion, you are gonna have to do that workaround for now anyway with the developer and then you select your user agent to trick it into thinking it's the older version of Mac OS X, but, but that's not a big deal. Um, anyway, my overall thoughts on this new Facebook video chat system, I like it so far. I think it's a uh, finally, I've been waiting for this for a while. Um, as far as the new chat bar on the side, I don't really like that, how it only lets you see who you recently chatted with and you can't even add or remove from that. So I don't really know how I feel about that. But other than that, it's good. Um, I like it. Rate, comment, subscribe, please. Leave your comments, question, feedback in the comment section below. Um, new giveaways coming up once you get a subscriber rate up. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another episode of TechSpot. Thanks for watching.